Hey guys, this crypto Marie, she does it all, a little bit of everything. I'm going to read this story to you guys about ABC News laying off people. ABC News lays off several senior executives amid broader Disney cost cutting and shock to newsroom. And uh, let's see. ABC News on Thursday stunned staffers laying off several senior executives and restructuring its newsrooms amid a broader workforce reduction being carried out by its parent company, Disney. People familiar with the matter told CNN. Throughout the company, teams are being impacted by the downsizing that was announced several weeks ago, including our own ABC News family. ABC News President Kim Godwin told staffers in a memo. While these actions are never easy, Godwin added in the memo obtained by CNN, they are a necessary step to ensure we are on the solid footing. My goodness, give me one second, guys. You know, when you're reading something and some ad come out of nowhere and stop what you were doing forgive me i'm gonna try to go back to where i stopped throughout the company teams are being impacted by the downsizing that was announced several weeks ago including our own abc news family abc news president kim Bodwin to our staffers in a memo while these actions are never easy the godwin added in a memo obtained by cnn they are a necessary step to ensure we are on a solid footing for the years ahead as we chart a sustainable growth-oriented path forward for the entire organization. Um, among the staffers let go, according to people familiar with the matter, were Senior Vice President of News Gathering, Wendy Fisher, Senior Vice President of Talent, Galen Gordon, Vice President of Talent, Mary Nonen, Los Angeles Bureau Chief David Herndon, Vice President of Communication, Allison Wignacht, uh, Senior Executive Producer, Chris Viasto, and Executive uh, Editorial Producer, Heather Riley. The Sea suited Bloodbath, astonished staffers at the network people familiar with the matter towards cnn there was a ton of shock that gone through the newsroom one abc news staffer towards cnn so many people with institutional knowledge are gone a person familiar with the matter said the cuts impacted approximately 50 roles across the organization including those that were open and yet to be filled while this is a difficult time for all of us particularly those directly in affected by these tough decision tough decision it's important to remember that together we are resilient and we will emerge from this period of transition stronger than before Godwin taught staffers in the memo. Godwin said she promoted London Bureau Chief Katie Dan Das to Vice President of News Gathering and that Executive Vice President Derek Medina will now oversee talent strategy. Godwin also said that investigating an enterprise unit will be overseas by Executive Editor and Senior Vice President of News Stakla Dashinku. In the coming days and weeks, we will share additional information about these teams and our plans. Godwin said the cuts come after Disney Chief Executive Bob Eager said last month that the media giant will lay off approximately 7,000 staffers. Eager said this week that the layoff had started and that they will take a month to complete. The cost cutting is not unique to Disney or ABC News. In the last several months, the media and technology sector has been battered by brutal economic uh, headwinds and uncertainty. Most major media and technology companies have conducted layoffs and downsizing while also working to trim costs wherever possible. 
my thing is it's not that those positions are not needed they fill them with somebody else so they had in mind to let go of those people it, it it was it wasn't um you know we don't need this position anymore we don't need those people uh we're gonna do something different no they were filled with different people so whatever happened to me was personal it's something they had in mind and they let go of them subscribe let me know how you feel bye bye